What's going on YouTube? This your boy Real Talk. You now tuned into Real Talk Media. Yo, I got a couple different things I'm gonna talk about today. So this will not be a music or hip hop or entertainment type related blog. So if that's what you're expecting, you might as well skip on to the next one. With that being said, when you hear words like University of Texas, Columbine, Sandy Hook, Virginia Tech, what do you think? Exactly. It's only one thing all them schools got in common, and that's somebody that went up in there and shot the school up. That's not nothing to be joked about, laughed at, that's not funny, that's not nothing. A lot of people lost their lives. It was a lot of hurt mothers and fathers and families, and matter of fact, they still hurting to this day. Just because time passed, them wounds ain't healed. So, what's up with Walmart? Having the nerd to post this little thing over top of a rack of guns, talking about on the school year like a hero. Over top of a bunch of guns. Really? It's not nowhere near the paper, the pencils, the highlighters, the calculators, the little trapper keeper. I don't know what the fuck they use. I'm getting a little old. The little zip up notebook binders, the book. It ain't nowhere near none of that. It's sitting on top of rifles and bullets and stuff, talking about on the school year like a pro. Who put that up there? Did y'all think that that was the proper place for it to go? Was the marketing and the ad people looking like, yeah, I think this is where it go? Or was one of the workers trying to be funny? Because I don't know about y'all, this ain't funny to me. I got a daughter now, so if somebody was to go up in her school and get the shooting, I might have a problem with that. I don't, man, look, Walmart, y'all need to step it up. So I guess Walmart to issue the statement talking about... What's seen in the photograph is never acceptable in none of our stores. We basically investigating to see how it happened. Or how, I, ain't, I ain't reading it right now. I'm still sitting here lightweight upset. You're investigating to see how it happened. Y'all be having all them boxes out there on the floor. Y'all have a worker go to their station or their section and y'all tell them to stock this stuff and put these signs up. So y'all knew what was in them boxes when y'all put them in them areas. Walmart ain't stupid. So what you need to do is go back to that section See who was stocking the stuff. And matter of fact, even the worker. When the worker put that right there, you ain't think, hey, hold on, maybe I should holler at my manager. Like, look, this ain't cool. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about this situation. Hit like if you like the video. Matter of fact, I don't care if you hit like or dislike because this ain't a story to be liking nothing on. Anyway, on to the next story. You think that one incident would be enough. It's never enough with Walmart. What's up with Walmart selling this, what they call it, a nigger brown do-rag, a wave cap or something? Yeah, you heard me right. I said nigger brown. This wasn't actually in the store. This was online, but it basically goes to show. Walmart don't care if you're black, white. They racist to everybody. Them was mostly all white schools where the uh, school shooters went up in there and shot up all them kids at. Now you online talk about nigger brown this. Who you gonna offend next? The Mexicans? The Chinese? Y'all need to get y'all PR people together and need to get y'all race relations and y'all like, I don't know, y'all just need to get on the same page because I notice it seemed like y'all keep going up in the prices, but y'all ain't giving the workers nothing. And then y'all keep doing this little dumb stuff and expecting us to keep shopping there. I ain't gonna lie, I'm probably still gonna shop there. <laughs> hey, I mean, I probably am unless it's like a black owned business or something a little closer they got what I need, but I'm probably still gonna go there. But I ain't going with my happy face. What are we going to do about this? Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about both of these situations. Hit that like button. Subscribe. And share this video. Shame on you, Walmart. Shame on you. I'm out. Oh, yeah. Follow me on Twitter at Real Talk Blogs. Blogs with an S. Follow me on Instagram at Real Talk Blogger. I'm out.